this the oldest business in Walkersville? As far to my knowledge, it is. Oh my gosh. And when was it opened? 1947. So give us, I mean, obviously you know a lot. So give us a little history of the business and right. how long Walkersville Lane has been here. Well, prior to 1947, it was a lumber mill. So it housed lumber, giving it the length that it had for the lanes. Near the railroad. Mm -hmm. So that was probably a really yeah. good, yeah. Mm -hmm. It uh, started as a bowling center in 1947. It's had four different owners. Okay. That's not a lot. No. <laughs> we are the fourth, and we've been here 30 years. Wow. 30 years. That is a really long time. Okay, so if we've been here for 30 years, then I would imagine you have already identified some of the challenges in owning a bowling alley. I know that the one in Frederick closed down. Um Growing up, I used to go to the one in Mount Airy by my parents' house. There's not a whole lot left out there. So tell me, what are the challenges? One of the basic challenges was when I first took over was duck pin, the sport itself. Duck pins was giving way to the 10 pin sport. So I had to try to get people interested back in the duck pin. So I mostly started with the kids and worked them up through. Personally, I have zero use for 10 pin. I would only do <laughs> duck pin because I'm really, first of all, I'm really bad at bowling, but duck pin makes me feel like I've accomplished something. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, it does. It's a harder sport. Oh, it is? Um, and because of that, you get three balls instead of the two. Oh. I find it to be a much harder sport. Anything can happen. You don't know who's going to win the game till the very last frame. Wow. Okay, well, you're going to get me excited about <laughs> I'm going to get you signed up. I know, you... I know. My kids, my kids, every time we drive by, are like, can we go? And mm -hmm. I was like, well, so the free bowling is not, it's not, it doesn't happen very often, right? No, it no. runs May through August. Got it. Oh, so we're just in the wrong season. Right. Right. Okay. The kids bowl free runs May through August. And kids bowl free May through August, right. like whenever you come. Right. For, mm -hmm. During free and free bowl time is when? Uh, generally from about 1 30 to 5. Oh my gosh. So, right around the time where it's too hot outside, you're sick of your kids, you got to figure out something to do before dinner, you can bring them here and bowl free. Yes. And they have to pay the shoe roll, but that's it. Okay, done. Like you're going to see me here more often. <laughs> what other programs do you offer to the community? Oh, we offer a lot. But one of the biggest ones is our private parties, and that's the biggest attraction. We try to keep the rate very low, mm -hmm. um, but you get Kids' idea. parties are crazy expensive. They are. And so are. the fact that you're like, we try to keep it low is really awesome. We do. We do. We have the birthday parties, mm -hmm. and we have a special thing. It's just a birthday party. You get full-time treatment. You do not have to just be thrown in a room. It's actually... we marginal lanes and we wait on you and take care of things. That's awesome. But the biggest thing we have is the um, private parties mm -hmm. because you can rent the whole bowling center. And that way it's just all you and all your guests. Oh my God. I have a uh, wedding get together and meet the people. That's so coming up in. That's such a great idea. Yeah. yeah. And then if you like, if I wanted to bring like all of my Walkersville clients and say, hey, come, that would be like the perfect day. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. The biggest thing we do is we rent the whole center and we get pizza and soaps. And you have the whole center to yourself for two hours and we keep it as reasonable as we possibly can. We love to hear that. And the last thing for the community I like to offer is employment. Oh. You know, we offer employment year round. Yeah. Today you have an interview with somebody. <laughs> I take men all the time because employment's important. Yeah. And I hire the young, young, just getting into high school. Um, and I've heard that a lot of times people prefer that, that demographic because if you get someone who's really good, they'll stay with you. It's like a reciprocal thing. They're they're a good employee, and they want to stay with you because, especially here, I'm sure working here feels like lonely. Yes, it is. Um, it's mostly a family business. I have myself, my husband, my son, and my niece all work here. And then all the others have become, been here 10, 15 years ago. Wow. That so, says a lot about a business. It's not a lot of turnover. Yeah. And you said you mentioned that you have one last program that's really important. And that's with the handicap. Yeah. We do a lot of work with the handicap. We have them coming on Mondays, Thursdays. And then there's I can imagine that this is like a, a it's, it's not so huge that there's like a lot of overstimulation. What do you hope is in the future for Walker's Plants? My future hope is that Walker's will always be because a lot of the centers have been put out by big corporations. And my hope is, should we sell Walker's Lanes any time down the road, it would be to somebody who loves it as much as we do. So not somebody who's just trying to get the building and you want to, even if you guys don't own it anymore, you want it to stay a bit. So. Yep. That's beautiful. That's right.
Thank you for letting me come in for you today. Oh, you're so <laughs> and I'm going to be coming back ASAP so that number one, I can work on my bowling score. Number two, I can get some pizza. And number three, I can just be surrounded with everybody here because everybody seems so lovely. This this is a nice, nice community within the bowling center. Um, we offer leagues, and in those leagues, we, we've got all the members of everybody's name. Everybody knows everybody. Having a small center like this makes that possible. It's like cheer before bowling. Yes, it. Yes, it is. It absolutely <laughs> is. <laughs> Where everybody knows your name. Thank you, Sue. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs>